my pals this is happy dinosaur 8000 coming to you coming to you with another episode of, of american review anime batch that's no that's that's part three and today i'm reviewing one punch one punch man and um this is actually pretty good like it's a satire or slash pair. I think it's more actually no. It's more of a parody. Yeah, actually, it's a parody of the of the superhero genre, and it's actually very clever. Like, I like I was talking with one on coworker of mine about the show, and he's like, "There is no conflict in this show at all." And I'm like, "I'm like there is, but not in the typical superhero sense." Like normally the conflict is I gotta stop this monster that's destroying the city. But but the conflict here with Saitama, um the main character is more like more like this. Why the hell can and I get ch a challenge in my life anymore? Why the hell is everything so easy? Easy why in the fuck is nothing a thing really exciting for me anymore, which is which is kind of in a end of a which is kind of a problem for him because he's basically a superhero for the thrill of it and the fun of it. But so basically, his conflict is his lack of like of regular superhero conflict. A lot of the time, there is is people fighting, eating, but for him, it's basically 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 a few a punch, punch. I'm sure a few punches, and they did. Ed, but um, and this this basically is we start off this the series, series with the origin of Saitama. Um, he was once a business businessman who was got unemployed, wait, and then later became a hero after saving a kid from a lobster lobster monster. Monster. And then and and sort of sort of sort of became sort of trained in for over three years, years to become a hero. And then and we see he he, he like um he, he Earth being invaded by I think they're called like the subterranean they the mole men is what Saitama calls them. Most of them and like he finally gets a challenge. He's like yes. I have not had a challenge in years. I never had this thrill in a while. Yes, and it cuts. That's 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 back to Saitama. Or after realizing it's a flashback. Heck, and then in Saitama, I'm a I'm a later eater meets eats eats Genos. And it was, it was basically, 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 he first seeing Saitama during his battle. So I think the thing is, the, lady, the monsters called the Mosquito Queen. And basically, basically, Genos is a cyborg that's turned up, that torn, it's torn apart by this monster. Unster, Unster, and Genos, and the sees is, is Saitama, and just kind of, and it destroy with a mosquito, you know, monster in one punch. He's like, teach me how to be strong like you are, or, or and he's and he's and, and, and Saitama just like, eh. fine. And and then, and, they, and he basically just tells Saitama his entire backstory, and he's like, and Saitama was just like, enough. You've been babbling on about this for this for like for like five, for like fifteen minutes. Can you shorten the damn thing at twenty words or less? Yes. Then, and Saitama and Genos take on a mad scientist obsessed as with with artificial evolution, leading to a battle, battle of Saitama. I'm a destroying, wing a super weapon. Epigenetic and a monster is after destroying like a laboratory. And then in the next ep episode, in episode three, you know, I, I'm just gonna, I forgot to say, a um, 
American Anime Review, sorry, American Review Anime, Anime Batch, is basically easily five episodes, and episodes, but still, go back to episode three. Episode three, he, a bunch of, bunch of communists and power armor are basically, dist are basically vandalizing the city. It, he, he and all shaved heads, much like Saitama. Um, and, and the news is like, hey, beware anyone with a shaved head. They are terrorists and they have shaved heads. As in Saitama just keeps getting any trouble from people. Where, he, where he's just like, look, I'm a superhero. Or I was like, and the, the guy was like, that, that shaved head, and you, and I don't know, so you're a freaking terrorist. Terrorist. And, um, basically, basically in this episode, episode, episode three, he, actually, actually, sorry, episode four, or episode three was the Mad Science episode. Sorry, episode four is, is where, is like this one with the, with the communist and power armor. We also meet eat this one ninja, whose name I can't remember. Where he said to be the world's greatest ninja, which I call bullcrap on that. That it's easy to spot you when you're wearing a shit ton of purple. Well, not many places to blend in with. With, and he'll flat out take off his, of his mask as can tell you who he is. When even I, who barely know a thing about ninjas, will tell you this. It's, it is said, in, in most ninjas, just, just that are retired. You know, we lurk in the shadows. It's completely secret. No one know, is supposed to know we're around. But anyway. Anyway, the ninja and Saitama fight. Right after, after battling the... And the the, sorry, the communist and power armor, or and then after that, after that, now yeah, we we see Saitama angry, because as as the super powered communist he was fighting, was it was basically like, he led him to the conclusion where he, where Saitama is just like, I've been a hero for for four years and yet no one fucking recognizes me. You see, and it's like, it, I just find it kind of an interesting, like, the reason why is, like, apparently there's a superhero union called the Hero Association. And I'm like, I find this genuinely hilarious, where it's like, it, it, just to imagine a bunch of superheroes be like, you know, like, to, like, one guy who just saved, he was a child, I old from a house fire, and they're like, you filthy scab! You ain't part of the union. <laughs> yeah, but um, so episode five, it was where Saitama and Genos, Genos joined the in the hero organization, join the hero association, and then, and we we see Genos gets a it's gets the gets the rank of class S. The ranks go from from C. B and A to S. S, and S is basically the top of the list as I just told you. You may eat, as I said, here's right. Genos got the, uh, the S ranking because he mastered through the physical exam as, as well as it was the as long as well as it was the written exams. Saitama got the ranking of C, and failed all the written exams, and but completely. Elite exceeded over with over expectations, Asians with the physical ones breaking records. Records, records with a C. And basically, basically, believe the episode of five is just sort of from initiation, them training a bit. Give it and we and we just end from there. Air, air leading into the next episode, and that is American Review Anime Anime Batch, Edge Edge Part Three. Yeah, and I give sight to Ama. Ama show One Punch Man. 
and I give this dinosaur approval, and I give it, give it I think, um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with like 8.7 out of 10. And, and that's my review. Chomp, chomp, everyone. Thanks for stopping by, and have a happy day.